do 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 it's the audio daily double check it out revamping uh something from like 2018 yeah uh, i mean this this kind of has been like a work in progress for a good while uh i've got like a a colored version of this might even like mix the colored version with this new kind of you know digitalized version you know because i feel like just just the practice of just scanning traditional shit and using my mouse with like sketchbook pro to make like free merch type shit i think that's the way to go right now you know but yeah yeah you know uh yeah, you know, it, it, it's, it's, it's something, you know, it, it's fun though. Uh, I, I was listening to a shitload of like Chance the Rapper, then I got into like some like John Bryan, which I'm gonna be real, the dude is like this generation's Burt Bacharach, hands down, like, oh my goodness, like her ghost? That is such a good ass song. Hunchstruck Love? Amazing fucking soundtrack. It's ridiculous. Eternal Sunshine of the Spotless Mind? Need I say more? Like, dude's a fucking legend. Even even with his work with uh, with Elliot Smith and shit, like, dude, I, just how? How can. Man. I feel like, uh, I feel like if there were, like, if Elliot Smith and John Bryan were, like, Paul McCartney and, like, John Lennon kind of shit, if they, if they were on that type shit, like, forming their own band, I think that we actually would have had, like, the next Beatles, like, hands down, I really do think that. But so be it. Shit happens. Dude, dude had to had to shank himself. But hey, what can you do, man? I, I, I still love that uh the Elliot Smith self titled. Like a, a dude can make smoking meth sound beautiful. I like smoking meth out of a light bulb. Like, he, he makes that sound like an elegant thing to do in his fucking songwriting. It's ridiculous. How do you do that? I don't know. I don't know. Only really Elliot Smith can. Just, you know, whatever, man. Fuck. Man. You know, I, I, can, I can geek out on music, like, for hours, man. I mean, because the thing is, like... All my friends, they're either, like, just classic rock fans, punk rock fans, or prog fans. And there, there's not much, like, overlap there. Like, of course they all got, like, eclectic music taste. But I'm, like, hesitant to go, like, yo, you, you, ever, heard of, you ever heard of this Argentine rock from the 60s? Like tipping fedora much like come on come on man you can't expect me to like pull that out out of nowhere on a fucking conversation but i have i have don't get me wrong but still though still though ah man you know it's 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 been good vibes though it's it's been real good vibes Uh, you ever think about how, like, hypnosis porn is, is really just rape fantasy porn with extra steps? I think about that a lot. That probably makes me a bad person. <laughs> Man. <clears throat> I 
wonder how many how many genuses of cheese are invented each year. Because there, like, with how many cheeses there are, there's got to be, like, at least 12. 12 that came out of 2020. Actually, no, no, with COVID, probably, like, three. But maybe, like, back in 2019, like, There's, there's, there's probably cheese pioneers that, that were like, hey, 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 check this out, check this out. If I combine this silly Italian word with this silly Latin word, oh my goodness, we got ourselves a cheese here. We're fucking set, we're, we're gonna make bank. Man. You know, this 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 has got me uh, th- fantasizing about being a cheese inventor. Oh man, that actually would be the bomb, though. That would be the fucking bomb, man. You know, y- y- you ever think about how Peter draws is like the the Mister Rogers of YouTube? He, he even makes music. He's actually... I, I He's got a song of his that's actually fucking decent. I, I actually really dig it. Like, it's, it's, it's the first song off of his, like, second album. And I've never heard anything like it. It's... it's oh, holy shit. Like, it, to already have, like, your own, like, carved out sound that's just so identifiably you just from your second album like that's that's fucking that's fucking impressive you know i mean i guess i accidentally stumbled on having a uh, like a sound of my own just by like trying and fucking up so horribly that I, I just ended up with a completely malformed version of whatever the hell. Of, uh, I don't know, man. But I'm, you know, the thing is though, my second album. I don't know if I even really count my second album because it's it's a shit post album. Like, if we're going chronologically. My first album was like ukulele music, kind of experimental indie rock shit, uh, with, with like a friend of mine recorded on a nine dollar microphone, bought on Amazon, into Audacity, and and mixed myself and shit. Now, going from that, like that's that's half shit post. It it was like half shit post, cause like it was like. You know, we were dumbass teenagers, so I was like, you know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna ask my nine year old brother to give me a song idea or some shit. I don't know if he was nine, but it is it's somewhere around there, I don't fucking know. But uh he was like What if you made a song about beavers shitting all over the place? I don't know if he said shitting I mean, judging by the environment of, like, uh, the, the kind of person that was uh, g- grown up around, but, uh, I don't know, I don't know. I, th- I think, I think probably, uh, probably said crap. Yeah, yeah, just beavers crapping all over the place. And, and that, that ended up becoming my first rap song. And and it's on YouTube. I mean, I, I, it's it's not like private or anything. I mean, I don't try to hide it. I, I just don't really go out of my own way to just say like, hey, check out this thing, this this god awful thing I made when I was fifteen. But you know, there's there's some there's something to be proud of in there. You know, I I mean, a lot of people waiting until their fucking forties to drop an album. So, at least I got that out of the way. So that's something. Still, though... 
back to my point. I, I, I went from half shit post to entire full on like I'm talking like meta anti joke kind of shit. Like I'm talking like I literally called myself under an alias living shit post. You know, those were some good ass times. I mean, I don't think, I don't think that kind of album could even be made nowadays anyways, just cause, just the environment it was made under, you know, cause it's just. I recorded it while, like, in a bunch of Skype calls with friends while I was, you know, in high school. Uh, just off school, just trying to fucking dick around, have some fun. Uh, you know. Basically just distracted myself from the hypno porn. But yeah, you know. Ah. <sighs> Still though, still though, it, that was, those were some good ass times. My second Living Shit Post album, I'm somehow proud of. I, I don't know how, I don't know why, but like for every single one of my Living Shit Post albums, like I, I fucking, I grinded tooth and nail. I don't know if that's how the saying goes for like the 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 sequencing. Like I don't think anybody has listened to those living shit post albums more than me. That's actually yeah. That's that's probably not even that that's that's not hard to imagine. That's really not. But still, still though, I like to imagine the. The the odd fellow here and there just showing up on band camp being like, Hey, hey, what's this what's this little uh, little fella named Living Shit Post? Am I am I gonna get uh am I gonna get cheated? Am I gonna feel cheated? Is this just gonna be some boring ass indie indie rock or some shit? Uh, am I gonna be like subjected to fucking sound collage? Am I? Am, am I? Am I uh, is that how I want to spend my afternoon? And then, and then you pop it on. You pop it on, and you hear a fucking chorus of kazoo's. You just hear a. And then it goes into a, a a bluegrass cover of "Fuck the Police" done on a on an out of tune mandolin. I mean, that 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 was my second album. <laughs> I mean, technically speaking, back in the day, this is the one thing that I ever released as Owen Larkin, like my actual like full name. It was it was it was a joke album like it was like an EP thing you know it was like twenty minutes you know it was it was like it was this friend of mine I, I met at like lunch you know she was chill we like bonded over uh, both of us listening to Neutral Milk Hotel but you know uh it. I just like talking to her and shit. So we had this like little, little inside joke thing that was kind of going on, kind of brewing. Like, I was like, "Hey, hey, hey, what, what, why the fuck do you keep on saying that you're gonna Skype call me, and 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 you never end up doing it? Like, like come the fuck on." So one day, one day I ended up. Just writing a song to bitch about it. And then just sending it to her. Like, Emma, I swear to fucking God. Get on Skype already. Jesus Christ. Something like that. But, it, yeah. That 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 was, that was the title. That was like... that The title was something like that. But... 
man. Yeah. It's good times, though. She was, like, one of the first uh, girls I ever smoked weed with, too. Good times. Good times. I had a crush on her before I realized that she was gay. But, you know, shit happens. It's honestly kind of fascinating how quickly your dick just stops working in that direction as soon as you find out they're gay. It's like, oh, oh, my chances are, are fucking shot. Whatever. Fuck this. Fuck this. Whatever. Whatever. You just, you do you. Just have fun. But then again, she's... I got some pet theories. She was kind of crushing over my older brother. And I, I like... I, I, I don't... Is that personal? Is that personal to say? But it, I don't know. I don't know. Whatever. Whatever. But... Yeah, yeah, she was, she was crushing over my older brother. So I think that she's probably, like, bi or some shit. But, like, I wasn't gonna test it. I wasn't gonna test it. Because it's just, like... Eh, at that point, it's like... It becomes, like... Do, do, you, do you not trust my gayness? Like, come on, man. We're, we're pals. We're, we're, you don't want to be buckaroos? I mean, she she was, like... Man, my, my first drum kit, which was like a MIDI drum kit, was like hers. She just uh, let, you know, me and uh, my best friend, like, borrow it, you know? It was, oh man, good times, good times. Uh, but yeah, uh, I, think the, uh, I think the video's over. Yeah. Anyways, uh, yeah, yeah, just, uh, have, have a good one. Have a good one. Yeah. You probably, you're probably gonna see a bit of, a, a bit of, like, you know, me tabbing out and shit. I mean, I, 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 I honestly could not be asked to, like, fucking cut that. I tried, I tried a little bit, but it's, it's four hours. Four hours. You expect me to pour through four hours and find... The five times that I tabbed out for like 13 seconds. Fuck no, pal. Fuck no. I'm not, I'm not doing that shit. S suck a fucking egg. Suck a fucking egg. Oh. Ugh. Anyways. Have a good one. Uh, by the way. I got you, uh, I, I got you... Little, uh, little secret. If you go on a uh, link tree with like a period after the R with a slash and then you type Owen Larkin Project Bundle, you can like get a link to all of my music. I mean, I, I kind of personally, I kind of omitted the, the stuff I made like in. in the 70 simpletons album because like i don't know i don't know if i want that like representing me because it's like that was like the first thing i ever made and it's just kind of i don't know i mean if, if, if you're curious if you're curious i mean it's out there it's out there have fun but like oh it's 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 a doozy it's a doozy i mean it has my first rap song so i guess that's something but still, though, I mean, I don't know. I don't know about it. I don't know about it. Anyways, uh, yeah, just this. This was the audio daily double. Do do do. do. Ha have a good one. You fucking simp's. Yeah, I think that's what I'll call you. The the, the simp's. Not like simp's as in like simp's. But, like, Simps is, like, an, ab an abbreviated simpleton. Yeah. Yeah, because you gotta be a at least a little bit stupid to enjoy my shit. Not gonna lie. I mean, come on. Just, just, just fucking listen to me for, like, two or three seconds. Like, come on. 
Anyways, I'll see you later, simps. Uh, have a good one.